Hello? Yes, hello. My name is Donald, and I'm calling from Victoria's Secret Customer Service. I was looking for Laura Vaughn. This is she. Hi, Laura. How are you today? I'm doing okay. How are you? Good. That's awesome sauce. I'm glad you're doing well. So, listen, we see that you ordered some of our items recently and wanted to check in and see how those items are working out for you. Okay. So, could you tell me a little bit about them? Uh, I'm not really sure which so, items you're referring to. Well, I see here that you received a teeny triangle top from our swimwear department. How's that going? Um, I, I guess it's going okay. Have you gotten it all wet yet? I'm sorry, what did you say? Well, it's a swimsuit, so have you gotten it nice and wet yet? No, I have not. So you haven't, like, uh, just ran through a garden hose or jumped in a pool or wet yourself down in any way? No, I haven't. Okay, so maybe you should try that out, just sort of soak it a little bit. What are you calling in reference to? Just this is sort of a customer service call just to make sure our items are doing well for Did you. Did I get selected for something or like? No, it's just uh, a courtesy call. My order sheet also says that you ordered some bras from us too in various colors and styles. Have you tried those bras on your naked body yet? Excuse me? I'm sorry. Maybe I should rephrase that. Have you tried on the bras when your body is in the nude? Like, Listen, this is incredibly unprofessional and inappropriate. I'm just asking how the items are working out for you, so... Yeah, but you don't I, have to phrase it like that. Like, what, that's not how you ask it. I don't understand. Uh, no, you should understand. If this is what industry you work in, you definitely should understand that that's not how you phrase it to, especially a woman. Well, I was just asking if the bras were working well on your naked body, and if you tried them right. on... why do you have to say naked? Like, that's implied. We know that. Well, Where else because, is the bra on your what? Well, you don't. You shouldn't be putting a bra over your shirt. So, I didn't know if you knew that or not. Um, I've been wearing a bra since I was twelve. Mm. I think I got that. This is not <laughs> professional at all, and I yes. would expect a lot more from Victoria's Secret. Well, so I'm shocked by this. I would call. agree with you. This is unprofessional because you just swore at me right there. So I Are would appreciate. Are you kidding me? And you the- called me. You called me and then talked about my naked body. I was asking about me. well, I was asking about the products, and then you just started swearing at me. I would appreciate it if you could keep this call professional. Swearing at you, I will say whatever the f- I want to you, just like you said that to me. I never said that word to you, so you I you think- said inappropriate language, like it's none of your business. Some creepy man sitting behind a f- phone in Ohio calling me talking about a naked body. I'm not in Ohio, so like oh, so a f- here is in Ohio, so you're obviously a. F- idiot in your mind. So maybe if you didn't know where the call center is, maybe you're the f***ing idiot. I don't know. It could be you. You f***ing just swore at me. So there it is again. You just swore at me one more time. Is it because you're attracted to me? I don't even know what you look like. Well, because like I was just asking about the normal things and then you started taking it to sort of a sexual level with me and I don't appreciate that at all. So So you started at that level Uh, by saying about bathing suits on naked bodies. It was the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. So if I could continue with this call, that would be awesome sauce because I haven't had a chance to ask you about your panties. You did not just f-ing ask me that after the entire conversation we just had. Are you hating me? I'm just wondering if how they're working out for you because, like, if are they hugging the right areas? And oh is- my god, I am f-ing done with you. I need to speak to your manager immediately. Ma'am, may-, may I remind you that these calls are monitored and you could be arrested for swearing over the phone? I don't know. If are you? you- f-ing no, You're serious. the one who's going to be arrested for the way you spoke to me. Are you f-ing kidding me? Well, what if I told you I was recording this phone call to play it on the radio? What? Yes, I'm just wondering. What are you talking about? I just want to speak to your manager. I no longer wish to speak to you. Please transfer me immediately. Well, I was getting insane. I was just going to tell you your husband, Michael, set you up for a prank phone call. That's all. What? This is actually Jubal from Brook and Jubal in the morning doing a phone tap on you. Your husband, Michael, set you up. Oh, my God. Are you serious? Yeah. He said he found the receipt for your Victoria's Secret purchases and wanted to mess with you. I cannot (laughs) believe it. So your husband wanted me to ask you, are the underwear working out for you or or, or are they not? Well, he is never going to see them again. So don't worry about that. (laughs)